Was that? No. Oh. Okay. Ooh. I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Come on, kid. We gotta get. That's it. Nail done. You're rescued. On the path. <laughs> I think... I think we're safe. That dog bit yeah. was horrible. Yeah, good. <laughs> I had tears in my eyes. Horrible. Hey, you all right? I, I think so. What are you doing out here? Where are the uh, the people you're with? There's no chance you made it this long on your own. I don't want them thinking we're doing anything but trying to help you. My friend and I got attacked. Hmm. These folks mentioned what they were after? They might have just wanted food. We were cooking some sort of weasel. They attacked you for a weasel? Damn. That is low. They didn't mention any names, right? They weren't searching for anybody? Hmm. Oh, what's well, up? I'm Luke. And this is Pete. Hey there. Hi. I'm Clementine. And it's nice to meet you, Clementine. But for now, we're gonna take you back to our group. Okay, we got a doctor with us, and you look like you could use some- Oh, shit! <laughs> what? What is it? She's- She's been bit, man. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. What are we gonna do here? <clears throat> no, it was a dog. I didn't see any dog, Clementine. Come on, kid. We just saw you with those lurkers back there. No, no, just look at it, please. <laughs> yeah, and have you sink your teeth into Pete's neck? No way. My neck? Why am I the one? Because I don't know a dog bite from a mosquito bite from a lurker bite, man. It's oh, not. Come on. Hmm, all right. Let's see it. Whoa, 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 hey, watch yourself. Hey, don't look at me like that. You're the one that's bit here, okay? See? Is it, uh, is it like she says? Hmm. Well, it could be a dog. Hard to say. So where'd this dog go? The one that did this. Now, what, what does that matter, Pete? Serious. It's probably his dog. I killed it. What? Really? A dog shows up and bites you and you just kill it? What would you have done? I don't know. It attacked me. Still, you don't... You don't kill dogs. I had to get it off of me. Clementine? Yes? You telling us the truth? You look me in the eyes when you answer. Of course I am. Yeah, she's telling the truth, you gay. All right, Clementine. Come on, just take her to no, safety. Well, what else was she gonna say? I've got a good bullshit detector, Luke. That's why you can never beat me at poker. <laughs> you don't always beat me at... All right, how can you be sure? Well, I'm sure I ain't willing to leave a little girl in the woods to die when we got a doctor with us that can make a call. We can have Carlos take a look at it first. Yeah. Nick ain't gonna like this. Not with what happened. You don't have to remind me of that, boy. Right. Sorry, sir. Get moving. Come on. Clementine, are you feeling all right? I'm fine. Just tired. Well, you better be fine. Because I ain't carrying you anymore with that bite on your arm. Don't worry about... And faint. Oh shit. He's carrying you. Hold on, for 
Sam. She already told us that she and her friend were attacked. Then she was bitten by a dog. What? And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Dog bite my ass. I need a dog. <gasps> Keep your finger off the trigger, boy. Whoa! Whoa! What the you fuck? You idiot! Every lurker for five miles probably heard You're the that. one telling me to fucking shoot her. Everybody just calm down for a second. Clementine, you okay? I just need a doctor. And then, and then I'll go. I don't want my arm to get infected. None of us want to get infected. That's the point. We got a doctor right here, okay? He'll have a look. Now what the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't act like we're the ones being irrational because we don't buy this bullshit story. No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing about this? Let me take a look. It's alright, just show him your arm. It's okay. Go ahead, he's a doctor. Damn, that must have hurt. Come on, it's a dog bite. You can tell. Hmm. Whatever it was, it got you good. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one's suggesting that. We could take her arm off. <gasps> uh, I know that worked for a cousin down in Ainsworth. We could try that. It won't do any good. You'll just be making it worse for the girl. It's crazy. No one's going to volunteer to do that. I would, if it means saving her life. Then You're in charge around here, right? You want to be sure about something like this. I'm on your side, kid. No need for a guilt trip. Who's she? Sarah. What I say, stay inside. I don't mean to be any trouble. I just want to stop the bleeding and then I'll go. You'll never see me again, I promise. And where exactly would you go? To find my friend Krista. Forget it. You won't get five feet. Look, I may be in the minority here, but my gut tells me she's telling the truth. It probably is just a dog bite. Probably. I'll just lock her up for a little bit, and if she doesn't turn, there you go. God, it's easy. So, what do you think? Was it a lurker? A bite like that could be anything. Only one way to find out. How? Oh. We wait. What? Wait. By tomorrow morning, if the fever set in, we'll know if she's gonna turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. <gasps> Sounds fair. What about my arm? It needs to get cleaned and, and stitched and bandaged. The girl is in bad shape, Carlos. Well, we have all that stuff inside the cabin. We could probably get by with it. please. But, yeah, we can't do nothing. I'm not wasting supplies on a lurker bite. If it turns out you're telling the truth, I'll clean it and stitch it up for you in the morning. But... She could die by then from I'm infection. Sorry. It's the best we're gonna get. Finger off the trigger, son. I ain't your son. Don't be like that, man. It's all right. Boy's got his mom's temper. Come on. All right, let's spend a night in the shed. A waste of time. You'll see. And when she turns, I ain't gonna be the one cleaning up the shed. And when she don't turn, it was a dog. You'll see. I guess we'll find out in the morning. If I last that long, maybe you could go look for it? I wish I could. I really do, but it's too risky. Sorry. Come on, Clementine. Go inside the shed. Because it's safer this way, 
And I'd rather be sure. Yeah, they could. <sighs> I can't believe this. Look at stuff, yeah. Life preserver. We're just gonna spend the night staring at stuff, is that it? Is that is that the goal here? You're not gonna like put your arm inside stuff, are you? <laughs> that would just be bad. Not much left in here. I guess if I have to, I can use this for stitches. Oh shit. Uh, we'll try that in a minute. Let me just uh, look everywhere first. Nothing? Alright, anything else? Anything else that is seeking attention? Climb on it. Aha! We have a hammer. Oh, it's gonna break. Oops. Oh, don't cut yourself again. Okay. Why are we prying boards again? Why can't we just wait till morning and then get stitches and be happy? What are we doing? This is just so gay. Oh, E. Alright, okay. Alright. Oh man, this is so bad. What are you doing? No! We have a doctor. He's gotta have stuff for stitches. Okay, hurry up then. Finding a way into the cabin. Come on. Hurry up. I've left a window open or something, which no. I think it's getting worse. Alright, now turn around. Turn around, turn around quickly. Let's go back this way. Can I climb over the logs? Or is that cheaty? This is gonna be for nothing. I'm not gonna be able to get in this way. But oh well. Oh shoot, they're in the window. Try here. <laughs> no, of course. Okay, down this way. Nope, oh, that's a bad end. There's only so many more places left to check. It makes me feel like a fucking idiot when we're not on the same page. We are on the same page. Not out there, we weren't. Not about the girl. I saw you get soft. What do you want me to do, Beck? Put a bullet in her? I want you to think about our family first. It's all I think about. So don't give me any shit. I need some air. She's gonna come outside or is she gonna open a window? 
Or do you think we could knock? Come on, be nice. Let me in. What the hell are you doing? I... I need your help. Me? No. I'm sorry, but I can't do nothing. Please. I need to fix my arm. Are you out of your mind? Even if you ain't bitten by some lurker, which you probably are, you can't be here. You gotta get out of here, you understand? Get back into that shed and Carlos will take care of you in the morning. You just let me die? I wouldn't let you do nothing. It's not my call. We're a group. But you could help. And if you don't, isn't that the same? I don't know, all right? It I'm is. serious. You need to get out of here. I saw when everyone was arguing. You wanted to help. Just help her. You didn't see anything. Look, you gotta get out of here before my wife finds you. I'm serious. You gotta go. I got enough problems already. Please help. Please. Come on, she's a kid. Don't, Don't be such cry. a tight ass. I'm not gonna cry. I'm just tired. You're not with Carver. No. And you didn't get bit by a dead person. No. I'll do anything I can to help your situation. Anything. Except leave me alone. Yeah, I guess. I'm screwed if anyone finds out I did this. You understand? Yes. What do you need? The bu the cut on my arm needs to be cleaned and stitched. Stitched? I ain't doing that. I'll figure it out on my own. All right, look. I don't know what I can find. We're short on bandages, but I might be able to find something clean that will work. I need something to clean it out with. And a needle and thread could help, too. I don't even know where to look. Carlos has medical supplies on lockdown. We don't got much these days. Well, whatever you can get, I'll find the rest on my own. Okay, wait here. Walker is gonna be coming out. I found you some bandages. And I, uh, I got you a juice box in case you're thirsty. Take it. Thank you. Alvin, house meeting in five minutes. Oh, okay, thanks. Now you need to go. Alright, so we got some bandages. Okay, nothing on the front door. <laughs> 